And before we get started, make sure you click the subscribe button, click the bell, make sure that you click all to get all the notifications for the videos that I drop. Yo, everybody, what is up? It's your boy Ghost Dog in the house, uh, back with another crystal opening video. Um, well, as you can see here, we got Alliance War Season 18 rewards. We finished Gold 1 um, with Dorks uh, last season. That's where we finished. So we're getting 2,000 six star stars. That's going to put me just over what I need to open up a six star. Gives me 10,000 uh, five star stars. So we're going to have four shots uh, at Silver Surfer. Um, man. And we even got an incursion crystal uh, that we can open up, which I will. Boom, right there. Incursion crystals, 27 1. All right. So we also have. We also have. Man, I got a four star crystal. Oh, I'm saving that four star crystal. But we got a legendary crystal. Which I'm kind of scared to open because if it, I'm not okay, so I'm only gonna open the four. Um, I'm only open the four, and here's the reason why. Um, if you haven't paid attention yet, as you can see, I'm allianceless. Yes, that is right. For the first time since 2017 of October or 20 of December 2017, uh, your boy is allianceless. Uh, it has been uh, determined. I got something else I'm working on. I'm going to bring that to you guys. We'll have a whole different video about that. So I want to kind of get that out of the way. But because I am, I got to be smarter so I can have more openings for you guys. Uh, so I'm going to only open the four, even if I get enough to open up a fifth uh, on stream today. We are going to open up the four so I can do something for you guys next week. Just in case I don't have enough shards build up uh, for next week either. All right, so I got the legendary crystal, which is probably going to give us a four star. Nine times of ten, four star is going to be a dupe. I also have a cavalier crystal, which could potentially be a four star, which could potentially be a dupe. They both could potentially be five stars that I don't have, or they could be, you know, the cavalier could also be a six star. Uh, so that would be kind of awesome if it was a six star. Cause that would probably help me even out my arena teams because I'll be opening up a six star crystal as well. I don't think I have anything else on this screen to open, but I do have other stuff to open. So we got three of these joints. Let's get them open. I've yet to ever pull a five star from this crystal. Uh, we're going to get them in the spinner real quick and we're going to stop them just as fast as we get them in. Uh, just so we can get a little spin, get a little excitement out of it. Right. Most likely going to be a three star, Never pulled a five star from this crystal, and I still have yet to pull a five star from this crystal. That is a three star hood. Any, any crystal that I get that gives me a four star will most likely be a dupe. Four star will push my crystal count over uh, to 50,000. I'm not opening no more than four today. You hear it here. Four. That's where I'm at. Four basic five stars. Four shots at your boy the Silver Surfer. All right, let that one spin a lot longer than I wanted to. It's going to bring me some luck. Nope, another three star. Three star Loki. Three star Loki. All right, let's get that out of there. Pretty soon, one day, I'm going to have to do a crystal cleanup. Uh, I think I'm going to, I might even do that next crystal opening. Might do what we call a crystal cleanup. Get the, uh, get in there, clean out all my crystals. Just get in there and purge the entire account. I got a ton of PHCs. All right, so there is a four star, first time four star Squirrel Girl from the Crystal. I have her as a five star dupe already. That is a first time four star pull from that. So that's decent. I'll take that. Not that I, you know, not that I'm going to do anything with her, but there you go. Still have yet to pull a five star from there. Um, all right, so now we're going to go back to uh, the legendary crystal. We'll start with that one, then we'll pick up the Cav Crystal. The Cav Crystal obviously has a chance at a six star. Um, these legendary crystals, I never do well with these when I get them. I got this one from the uh, Black ISO market for 5,000 uh, four star shards. I still have 10,000, let's say 15,000 four star shards saved up. I only open up the four star shards now when I'm really in need of ISO. Um, them and the PHCs and 
free star ones. I'm, I, I mean, I have tons of all of them now. I remember when I used to open them up just for the show, and now I have them by by the boatload. Um, so there's that. Get that to come to a stop. I would have, you know, wrong shot would have been a five star. That'd have been kind of cool. Well, that is another four star, but no do. We'll take that. We'll take that. I, two new five star or two new four stars out of that. Um, we prefer the five star. I'd have loved to play with him, but I can, I can break him up a little bit, test him out, see you know, see what all the hype is about long shot. Right, we have one more crystal on this page. That is the Cavalier crystal. The Cavalier crystal here. Uh, I got this from the Sunday thing for five dollars. The six stones come with it. I'll be purchasing those until I get Doom the Sig. Uh, 200 uh, that is the goal I need to keep putting seeds into them to get them to sig 200 especially now more than ever as I'm not gonna be doing the Alliance thing all right oh look at that look at that look at that skip fast oh I almost got the six star Hawkbuster I would have liked that I don't have him as a five star and that buff is coming not that I could really say I'd find a place for him uh, but it'd be kind of fun just to play with him and uh, do some videos with him all right, so we got a three star out of that. All right, so we made through all those crystals, three stars, four, and brand new four stars, but nothing else. That's kind of a weird thing. So, hmm. All right, well, let's get to the, uh, so this is what we got. I got four of these I'm gonna open. I'm gonna get them all, get them all loaded in. After I open these four, depending on what I get from these four, will determine the crystal that I'm going to go after. We are going to pep him up though, because uh, your boy needs it. Your boy needs to pep it up. I need the luck. I need, I want to get my hands on that Silver Surf. If you watched my last Chris Open video, you seen I had all that cosmic stuff waiting around. Waiting around for him. I, I mean, a good cosmic champ. I don't, Venom the Duck doesn't really need to be awakened. I don't know if I'd necessarily give him the awakening gem. Uh, but somebody, he, I know I have Captain Marvel movie as a six star, but as a five star, I could take her to Sig 200 and and, Mac, and rank five her. I don't know if that'd be a great play. I mean, we'll see. Um, who else we got in here? Uh, Annihilus would be kind of cool to get, get my hands on. Um, I don't know much about Terax. I don't know, I mean... We've seen him. I haven't played with him, so I wouldn't know if he'd be good to pull. Um, all right, so we're getting in here. Let's go. But Surfer's who we want. I don't even see Surfer in the real. Is Surfer even in that real? Domino would have been cool. <gasps> finally! Finally! I finally pulled Wasp. What do you know about that? I finally pulled Wasp. I've been looking for Wasp ever since I got Ghost. Now I have no excuse. I can't say, well... I can't really, I don't want to learn how to use ghosts because I don't have Wasp as a five-star to take her into Act 6, so it don't make no sense to pull her. Well, I pulled her now. So, all right. Second crystal in the reel. I, I, I'm trying to see if I see Silver Surfer. That's the problem. I don't see him. I don't see him in the reel. That is an issue. That is an issue. If you don't see him in the real, does he pop up just all of a sudden out of nowhere? <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of good champs in here I see. Like, I take the Annihilus. I take uh, I take the Namor. I don't know if I'd really do anything with Namor. It sounds like he needs to be awakened in the high sig to really have a good time with him. Then the Duck would be somebody I wouldn't mind having. Um, run incursions. I heard he's really good for incursions. I don't know if I'd do anything with the Human Torch since I already have. I'll take that. That is new champion number two, Emma. I did not have an Emma, and she could work out well in Act 6-4, uh, which if you guys don't know, I'm going to be working on exploring Act 6. Uh, I am going to I'm going to reset this reel because, uh, like I said, I don't see him. I didn't see Silver Surfer at all in that one. And I'm starting to think what you see in the real is what's going to come around. Although I didn't see Wasp. 
to be honest with you the first time. And I didn't think I seen Emma. And there's Longshot in here, and there's Medusa. I don't have Medusa either. Although, at this time, I don't know if I really would rank up Medusa. She's all right for me. Um, I don't know where I would use her at currently. Um, with the roster I currently have, it'd be kind of tough to kind of fit her in. Uh, man, I really, really, really don't see Silver Surfer in here. That is, that is tough, man. I also don't see t people like Guillotine 2099. Um, Crystal stopped on its own. I think I'm going to get shafted on this one, y'all. Oh, that's an Awakening. First time Awakening on X23. I'll take that. First time Awakening. Um, gives her her frenzy, which is kind of cool. Uh, I just ranked for her, I don't know, a few months back. I had to use some mutant uh, T4C. T4 uh, and, and I needed to get some T21s out of the inventory. Uh, so there, that was an easy rank up. All right, cool. Last crystal. Last one. Last opportunity. Like I'm saying, I'm not even seeing Silver Surfer. I guess that doesn't work if I don't do it that way, huh? I'm not even seeing him in the real. But I do see Captain Marvel movie. If I pull Captain Marvel movie, I will take her to rank four. I will awaken her, and I will possibly take her to rank five. I can't see the problem having two Captain Marvel movies. Uh, I probably would seek 200 her. Um, and I'd be just happy and go on about my merry way. It'd be nice to have Silver Surfer. It'd be nice to have a, a rank five, six, 200 Silver Surfer. But if I don't, I might just go ahead and uh, do that. All right, let's see what we're gonna get. I see, she's in the reel a whole lot, a whole lot. All right, so that was coming to a stop. And the next we'll go out, we'll go get the Incursion Crystal. Hey, double dupe. That one I'm not as excited about. <laughs> but it is good uh, ISO for Emma. Uh, I'll be able to take Emma up next. Uh, I'm going to definitely have to get her to minimum rank four. Uh, but I'm probably going to get her to rank three for a little while. Learn how to use her. i kind of upset because I just used my Mutant Awakening gem on, um, on Havoc. But neither one of them really need it. So that's okay. That's all right. All right, so cool. So we got those out the way. Uh, let's go out, let's go buy the Incursion Crystal. Let's talk about that real quick, what my thought process is. Now, there's not really a whole lot in the Incursion Crystals that I want, where am I at? Let's see, Incursion, boom. All right, so let's take a quick glance at them. All right, so this particular one has Warlock, who I have, Elsa Blumster, who I have, Mycroft, who I have, Mr. Sinister, who I have, Proxima Midnight, who I have, Abomination, who I have, Sentry, who I already have, Mordo, who I have, and Diablo, who I have. So nine out of the 10 characters in here, I have them. And it's not really that great of a crystal. Like Elsa Bloodstone would be an awakening. Uh, Sinister would be an awakening. Proxima Midnight would be an awakening. Abomination would be awakening. Sentry would be awakening. Uh, Diablo would be awakening. But none of those champs are really going to do anything for my current roster. The Nightmare Crystal has the boy in it, Dr. Doom, which would be 20 more sick levels of my Dr. Doom, which means less six stones I have to open up and or purchase uh, to get him there. Guillotine 2099, that's an important one. Um, I have a 2 to 3 and a 3 to 4. I've been saving for a good tech to rank up. Uh, I've thought about throwing him in the Sentinel, but I'm like, eh. I really don't need Sentinel, but Gillen 2099 would be fun to take into quest and get, get some stuff done. Uh, we have Korg, which would be an awakening. Black Panther, Civil War would be an awakening. Cyclops, Blue Team would be an awakening. Uh, these won't be awakened. These actually be dupes. Uh, all three of those are dupes. I already have them awakened. Magneto, who we just heard. If you haven't listened to the rollback yet, I'll talk about that in a different video. Magneto, uh, who I have would be, I think that would be a first time awakening. Um, but it's getting a buff. Heimdall, which would be another dupe. I already have him. Vendor Duck, who I don't have, which I said I, I just said I didn't have. And then my Arch Emesis enemy crystal. He's in every one of the crystals I really want to open up. Spider-Man Miles Morales. He's in every one of them, and I get him every time. Like, it's without fail. <laughs> All right, so the Genesis crystal. We have Void, who I don't have. 
Black Widow Clairvoyant, which would be a Max C Crystal. Punisher 299. I think that would be a first time awakening. Vulture, I think, would be a dupe. It'd be a second time dupe. Winter Soldier, who I don't think I have. Uh, Ronan would be a first time awakening. Psylocke would be a first time awakening, I believe. Beast, I don't think I have. And Vision Arcus, who I wouldn't mind getting my hands on. So in reality, the two crystals so far that I think I'm going to either go for is the Nightmare Crystal or the Genesis Crystal. And I'm probably going to go for the Genesis Crystal first. But let's take a look at the other ones real quick just to make sure I'm not missing out on anything. Um, Corvus Glaive, who I already have a six-star awakened. Hawk Rags, who I already have awakened. Dr. Voodoo, who I don't have. Man Thing, who I don't have. But those two characters, I can be, I'll be all right without because I have other characters that do what they do. Um... Ultron, who I have already awakened. Civil Warrior awakened. Karnak already have awakened. Night Thrasher, which would be a first time awakening, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Gambit would be a first, no. Would that be a first time awakening? Probably. And then Old Man Logan. All right, so, which would be a first time awakening Old Man Logan, I believe. I don't think I've awakened him yet. I may have. But that crystal right there doesn't excite me. The War Crystal has Domino, who I don't have, who I haven't had. I have Red Hawk and I have Masakre, but that's it. <laughs> uh, Hyperion would be just more sig levels on him, which is not necessarily needed. Electro, who I just awakened last week. Luke Cage would just be a first time awakening. Hood, who I already have awakened. Doctor Strange, who I don't have, so it'd be an exclusive champ uh, that I don't have. Um, Rocket Raccoon, uh, who I don't need awakened, I already have awakened. Mysterio as a five star. I think it would be a first time awakening. I think I have him as a five star, but I got him as a six. So I'm not doing much with him right now. Falcon or Kingpin. The Kingpin I don't have, but that crystal does not excite me either. Uh, and then the Death Crystal. Um, you got Blade, who I have Max Sig. Sunspot, which would be interesting. I'd be another mutant that I could I could actually bring in and do something with. Drax Enihilus, which I just said I wouldn't mind getting my hands on him. Ant-Man, Hawk, Dormammu, Guillotine, OG Guillotine, not 2099. Iron Man or Howard the Bell. Okay, so this is how I'm viewing it. I got 90 days, which means I probably can get three of these crystals, maybe four over 90 days. But I think what I want to do because of my predicament of I have a cosmic uh, six stones getting ready to expire and either I'm going to put them into somebody I really don't want to put them into um, or I can go ahead and max sig and rank five, somebody I don't have. Uh, Void would be great, because I don't have him. And let's see, uh, who else was on? Vision Arcus. Vision Arcus would be awesome. Uh, so I'm gonna go after Vision Arcus, Void, who I can use Void in Act 6.2. I think that'd be um, a good way of going about it. So let's get back into it real quick. <laughs> Uh, Void had helped me out a lot on a uh, on there's a certain pass in 6.2.5 uh, and against that Mordo boss. That if I can get him, get him awakened, uh, and get some sig on him, then it, it'll just help me out that much more. All right, so let's find the incursion crystal. There it is, the Genesis one. Get it in, come back out, get back in, come back out. Back in. Go one, two, three. Uh, get it in there. All right. Well, we know it's gonna be a five star. I don't. The champion boss. The champion doesn't really do anything for me. I, I would do nothing with them. Vision Arcus, Void. Vision Arcus and Void. That's who I want out of this crystal. I also want a soldier would be a win. Um, Ronan Awakening would be a win. Um, it wouldn't be a win. It'd be an okay thing. I, I wouldn't be overly excited about it. But Void and Vision Arcus. Void, Vision Arcus. Where the soldier would work. No. No, not him. I, one over. One over, Void. Ah, man, that hurts. Yeah, I believe that. Yeah. It's awakening number two. Well, it's more ISO. More, more six-star shards. That hurts a little bit. All right, y'all. Well, it brings us up to uh, the six-star crystal. So we know that Dr. Doom just got at it. Um, but honestly, who I would like to see out of here, personally, um, I mean, if it's not going to be a brand new six-star, 
uh, that would help with some Rita points. I would like to see Stealth suit Spidey. And the reason is I can rank three him right now. Um, he does nothing for my prestige unawakened, but awaken it just at 26 at rank three, he goes to the top of my prestige board. Um, is that the only reason why I really want him? I think he's really good as well. Um, it also increases his fury, keep, increases his attack when he's awakened. Um, so we got that as a, as a bonus there. Uh, but any other decent six star, uh, that doesn't need to be waking like a guillotine 2099. Um, I, I don't, I don't want to see someone I currently have at rank five. Um, and there's a few of those in here. So let's hope for something. These just take so long. And now I'm not, I'm not an alliance. It's going to take even longer for me to build up my six stars. I don't think it's guillotine. <laughs> well, I hope they buff him. <laughs> I hope they buff both Magnetos. Oh, man. Are you kidding me? Such a hard stop on them, too. It was like, no doubt. All right, y'all. Well, that's your boy's openings right there. Man, that is not what I was expecting as a six star. Oh, well. If you liked the video, I hope that you did. Make sure you click the like button uh, before you go. If you're not a subscriber, hit the subscribe button. This is a 1K giveaway video, so make sure you share it out um, with your, your alliance mates, your Twitter followers, your wherever you wherever you want to share it out. At. Be part of the 1K giveaway. That giveaway does end, uh, of the entries for that giveaway does end on Sunday, Father's Day, June 21st. June 21st is the last day, Father's Day, Sunday. All right, y'all. Well, I guess until the next video, I'll catch you next time. Peace.